Hello, everybody. Welcome back to Astroneer with your friend Kuros Paladin. And it's only been a few minutes for me, but it's probably been a week or so for the rest of you. Uh, and here we are uh, in our last episode. Managed to get our large shuttle. Got very lucky. Just happened to find titanium alloy on Glacio. And boom, that allowed us to build the large shuttle without having to go through all the intermediary steps. Uh, I do have a reward to collect, the wholesome produce. Uh, I finished that mission. I didn't realize it was pending. I happened to plant over here. You can see my little garden. I happened to plant some of these and that finished that. It gets a medium storage silo, which is very useful. And proximity repeaters, I haven't really found a good use for those yet. Um... I guess the what I don't like about the proximity repeaters, I, I, I shouldn't say I don't, it's not their fault. <laughs> because, you know, it really can't be their fault. They're not, they're just things. But what I do not understand uh, with this entire thing is why are some plants harvestable using F and you can just pick them up? And why are just some, do you have to uh, dig them up? what was the 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 decision there because these are ranged hazardous these are range hazardous um these are you know proximity these are proximity if you dig them up these are if you get right on top of them so i don't know what the decision was of which ones have to be dug up and which ones don't um it would have been nice if they could have just been consistent and you can just hit F on all of them and not have to deal with this digging up and such. But, alas. So this episode, what I want to do, we got our shuttle. I want to get a hydrazine thruster and stop using solid fuel thrusters. So we're going to try and get the hydrazine thruster... Excuse me. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm a little tired. <laughs> uh, hydrazine thruster, which we need steel, so I had to go back to Glacio and get the steel because I need argon. We printed, we, I, whatever, printed a um, atmospheric condenser. So we got it right there. I had this sitting around from before. I'm going to take the medium generator because definitely going to need that power with the... Um, uh, with the atmospheric condenser. So I'm going to go look for ammonium. I know I got ammonium right here. I want to leave this for an auto extractor. I don't want to disturb that. That's a good deposit for an auto extractor. So I'd rather spend a few minutes going around looking for some and leave that really good deposit for an auto extractor and get a good amount of ammonium out of it. So hopefully I don't have to look too far um, for ammonium. Uh, I do know there's been nightmares before where I've searched for, you know, 30, 40 minutes and finally found ammonium. Uh, and other times, you know, I just trip on it and it's like, oh, here it is. So, um, it's usually in these hilly areas. I'm trying to look at the entire screen to all the entire field of vision here to make certain it's, uh, you know, I'm not going right by it. Um, but it is very easy to miss it. Um, okay, I'm going to go this way. I see some resin over here. Boom. Ah, there we go. Uh, resin... It looks like a crash. Oh, nope, that's an Exo Research Aid. Over the resin, through the woods. Alright, let's go. Oh, here we go. I found some. That's actually not a bad deposit. No, I should have been paying attention. Oh, good. Okay, I only have that, and I can just put that there for the moment. Okay. So let's go ahead and pick up as much ammonium as I can while I'm over here. It's 
one resin. Or uh, resin, I'm sorry, ammonium. Two. Three. Surprised I haven't got organic in any of this yet. Four. Up oh, there's the organic. I knew it was going to show up eventually. Five. Six. One more. Seven. There we go. Okay. Oh! That's right. I dropped the storage silo, so grab one more. Eight. Okay. Uh, we'll just leave you there. I may come back here in the future, if I can remember where this is. Uh, can I get around this? Because going through that was a pain. Where is the base? Mm, wow, this forest just goes on and on. Alright, I guess it would have been faster to just go through it. Alright. Maybe I'll find more ammonium as I zing through here. Bonk. I knew that was going to happen. Uh, up, 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 up. Got a cat playing. She wants to play as well, so she just made me hit F on the keyboard. My wonderful kitty, Dax, your co astroneer this evening. Okay. I'm not out of the woods yet. Alright, so over here. Half the episode is just getting ammonium. Woohoo! Oh my goodness. Okay, this is going to take a while. Um, let's not go through the rocks then. Let's go this way. Come on, just get through the trees. Get through the trees. I see clear space. I can do it. Yay. Okay. Whew. Ugh. That's stressful. Alright. Just park right here. Ow. Now my co astroneer is clawing me. Ow. Hun, please. Okay. Uh, where'd that research go? Did I already... I guess I, that was what just finished then. Okay. I'm going to find it later, aren't I? I thought it was over here, but I must have... Okay. Alright, ammonium. So ammonium and aluminum for a solid fuel thruster. Let's go ahead and do that. And then, with the, let's just leave the other seven sitting here. There we go. All right, we've got that uh, sitting on here. Let's grab that because this could be useful. All right, we're going to head off to Silva. Uh, Silva? <laughs> I'm on Silva. Head off to that other planet, Glacio. Oh, it's so tiring. So just to let you guys know, uh, those of you watching, um, I got a call just a couple days ago from the director of the current of the play that's about to come up in March. Um, he had one of his actors have to drop out. Um, and the director called me and said, would you do this for me? Uh, would you play this, you know, would you fill in for me? Uh, I said, yes, the part, it's a bit part, only has about 30 lines. Uh, the play is Death Trap. Um, really good play. Um, and, uh, anyhow, 
I have rehearsals for that. I just got home from a rehearsal for a improv murder mystery that I'm doing later this week. And then I am directing the May show. So I have been very busy the past couple days. Uh, and I will be very busy for the next couple months, unfortunately, because I've got the show. Uh, and a lot of rehearsals for that, Death Trap. And then right in, while Death Trap, I'm on stage doing that. And... Uh, I'll be also doing rehearsals for the show I'm directing in May, which is Move Over Mrs. Markham. Um, so I'm going to be really busy. So I know my schedule has been sporadic. I apologize. My schedule will probably continue to be sporadic. I love playing these games. Um, but recording an episode... Like this, as much as I love doing it, I don't get to play because I spend a lot of time... You know, once I'm done recording this, it's about another hour and a half of render, editing, rendering, and all that other fun stuff. But anyhow, I really do hope that uh, I can keep things moving in the future uh, and get regular content coming out. So, all right, what I'm going to do here... Um, because I want to get, um, what am I trying to do? Okay. I wanted this. <sighs> I thought I had that locked. Oh my god, this is why you lock platforms, so you don't pick them up like that. Okay. I want to pick that up. There we go. Okay. And then, one, two... That's what I was after. Okay. And then where'd that generator go? Right there. Okay, I'm trying... Uh, I'm trying to do so much and fail at it. I need some more organic. Right here, this should be good. One, two, three. That should be more than enough. I got some cataplants over there I should be aware of. Alright, so I want another platform. That's what I'm starting right here. Um, we're just going to... No! <sighs> Frog. Alright, we're going to do this. I... I want the oxygenator. I need the other platform. <laughs> I need the other platform. Okay. We're going to turn that off. Okay. I need the other platform for the atmospheric condenser. Uh, and actually, I do have a platform right here that I forgot about. So let's go ahead and unpack this. This base is not going to be very well laid out because it is just a temporary thing. So normally I'm very, as you've seen before, OCD about my bases. Um, but this one... I just want to get things going, so... Okay, atmospheric condenser, let's drop you down. Let's get you set down here. Excellent, you've got a little bit of carbon there, so what we're going to do is that. We can turn that off. And now I can just work on... straight up, uh... smelting. Okay. Turn that off. Oh, and it just ran out. Oh, that's it was like perfect timing. Okay. So let's go ahead. I'm gonna set that there. Okay. Now I have an actual print station. So I can set all this down. There we go. I can put the generate this little generator here. Um, okay. Good. All right. All right. I want argon. The whole reason I came here. 100 PPU. 
turn that on. And then I'm going to move that over there and hope I can get... I mean, at 100 PPU, it should fill fairly quick. Um, I'm going to go... There's one more aura carbons here. But I'm going to go grab some more organic so I have some more carbon. Of course, that means I'm going to have to run the smelter while their atmospheric condenser is going. Oh, watch this. Oh, wow. Ready? Oh, just two? I thought I was going to get a lot more than that. One more. One more. There we go. Okay. And of course, I also wanted, while I was here, I wanted to get some bites from underground. So, so now I'm going to end up biting into the uh, argon production. Actually, I can turn that off. Here's what I'll do. I'll let that finish out that canister. Get right up into it. Right up in under it there. Yeah, okay. How's that looking there? Uh, yeah, that, that canister looks good. <laughs> he looks like he's inspecting it, you know? <laughs> okay. And boom, it's done. Let's turn this back on. Oh, and look at that from thin air. I got that mission as well. Okay. Composite perfection. Oh, and I already have done that, but oh well. Um, composite perfection, I think, is just make something in the chemistry lab. I, I want to get plenty of carbon so I can just run this thing almost nonstop. Because I want to get as much argon going as I can. I will not be able to fill this, but... The more I can get early on, the better. Uh, and then I've got my one canister of it. So actually I can... Come on. Arg. There we go. Okay. Uh, let's go ahead and start you up again. There. So with all that carbon, I should be able to get quite a bit of argon. I really should. Um, let's put this over here. Okay. All right. So that's going to chew on that for a bit. Um... I wanted my solid fuel thruster, or I'm sorry, my hydrazine thruster, so yeah, I need that steel. So I actually have everything I need for steel. I could just walk away, and this will just stop when it stops. I can come back in a little bit, and it'll be wherever it's at. So I think that's what I'm going to do, because my objective was solid fuel thrust. I'm sorry, hydrazine thruster, and I've got what I needed from here. We'll just let this run until it's done, uh, so I don't have to sit here and watch it. Um, so let's head back to Silva. Um, do I need to take anything? Yeah, I'm going to take this, because uh, we want to research. Oh, I did say I wanted to go to the underworld and grab some research. So let's, I'm going to try and see how far underworld I can get. How's that? Um, so let's... Uh, I'm going to need some compound because I only got... I don't have a lot of tethers. Let's get a few more compound here. Or at least one. Okay, that'll work. And as far as where to go into the underworld? Right here looks good. 
I mean, there's really just wherever and just pick a spot and go, so. I don't have to make this large enough for vehicles. I don't know why I always do that, but. Okay, let's get a tether nearby, though. Already getting into the difficult uh, rock. But that's not uncommon. There we go. And see if I can find some titanium down here, too. I do have the drill that I could speed this up with, but I don't want to draw power from up above if I don't have to. Okay. So, while I'm waiting for some more Aragon, I can do this. Because I would like to get some more Bites. And some Titanium. Because I, I did say that. I remember saying I wanted Titanium and Bites. So I'm glad I remembered. Because, as all my viewers know that have been watching me for a while, my memory is terrible. So, oh, look at this. Oh, this is awesome. Right here. Four of them. Three. Four. Oh, yeah, look at that. Plenty of bites right there. Look at that. 4,800 now. Um, let's not lose sight of our tethers, though. Um, let's just head this way and look around the corner. Poke our little astroneer nose over here. And we've got one right there. Boom. So I want to say it was around 30... I had about... 3,600 before I started. Now I'm up to 5,100. So look at that. That's It's just great picking up uh, bites over here. Uh, how about just heading this way then? I don't see any titanium. Usually it stands right out. You can see those green uh, spiky bits. So we'll go around this. A lot of hispines around here. Oh, out of tethers. Uh, some laterite. There's some research. Another hispine way over there. A boom balloon. An upside down pop coral. Huh. But no titanite nearby. How unfortunate. I should also be looking for compound. Oh, I've got. Okay. I just realized I have compound. So let me print up a bundle of tethers. I'm going to have to draw a little bit of power from up above. And we'll head this way. And see if I can find any tight night this way. So I'm just going to head straight out to here and then look both directions. Poker astroneer nose over here. N nothing. No tight night. Poker astroneer astroneer nose over here. There's some right over there. Okay. There might be some a little bit closer, but so far that's all that I've seen. 
There's some over there. Okay. They're both about equidistant. We'll branch off this way, though, so... Down... There... 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 Actually, this kind of heads towards both the sets anyhow. And there, okay. Because I want to go a little bit further, and there's even some more over there. Excellent. This doesn't look like a lot over here, though. Oh, okay, I am going to have to use this. I forgot that, uh, yeah. So I'm going to be burning through that power. But I want some Titanite. I find myself pushing down on the mouse button much harder. Because, of course, that will make it, you know, <laughs> dig faster. Oh, there we go. We got some soft soil down here. So, oh yeah, this is really good. Because now I don't have to use the drill. Let me turn the drill off. <laughs> oh yeah, okay. All right. Well, I got tight night. <laughs> um, look around for just a little more research. Circle back. Looking for research on the way. Here's some more. Where are we up to? Look at that. 7,200. Doubled. We were at about 3,600. Now we're at 72. So, I like, this is probably, Glacio is probably my second favorite planet in the game. The, it has a lot of very useful resources. Um, and the, it's not that difficult of a planet. Okay, let's head back up to the surface. <laughs> right there, that's where I found that titanium alloy. Okay, these are disturbing me. I'm just... They need to re be relocated. I'm just afraid that I'm going to wander by it and not notice it. Okay, there we go. And then I can replant these. Excellent. Alright. Um, that generator is still going. One, two, three, four, five. And about to spit out a sixth. So 30 argon. Not bad. Not bad at all. Um, in fact, will I be able to get... Will I be able to get... Um, one more? Come on. Because I want to print a medium, uh, 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 medium storage if I can. And I need the power from this. It would have been neat if the carbon would vibrate with the generator as well. And there it goes. Okay, we're going to turn that off. We're going to put that to nothing for the moment. Plenty of argon for the time being. Let's get these dragon eggs loaded up. And I want to go grab... One more resin from somewhere. So drop off all this. Now I have another co astroneer So my other kitty is now present and 
Making things difficult for me. Hi, Vosh. Okay, I want resin, and there's none this way. It's all the other direction. Oh, here we go. Because I, I want to print a medium storage so I can carry this stuff back. And you can never have too much resin. I don't know if you've... I can't remember if it was my YouTube's uh, video or not where I actually collected 400 resin and managed to go through nearly all of it. Um, you just almost always need resin. Okay, head back. Nice to know I've got some clay here because... I'll probably have the final base be down in this little valley. And I'll put a landing pad there. And that's two clay and a aluminum. Alright, so come back over to here. I want... Medium storage. Do that. So it's ready to go. One, two... Three, four. You do not get to keep those, though. There we go. Five, six. We'll burn through that first. That might be enough right there. Okay, put you there. Boom. Oops. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, I got everything I needed with just the the organic or the small generator. Put the dragon egg up there. Unpack this, and we're gonna take back one, two, three, four, five. Six, seven, so that's 35 argon. Not a bad haul. Not a bad haul at all. Um, okay. And then I want some of this iron as well. <laughs> And I can just put that in the backpack. Put you there. Four. Do I have any more iron? Nope. Okay. All right. So I think I'm almost there. I just need to do the steel, and that's the... Uh, I have the argon. I have, I'll have. i be able to get carbon. Yep. And uh, hopefully I will be done with solid fuel thrusters. And then I can get back and forth around this solar system a lot easier. But this large shuttle, oh, you know, I understand why they have you do, you know, the medium shuttle because it's a challenge, but if I try to skip the medium shuttle if I can, just like I try to skip the medium drill, uh, the medium rover, uh, they're nice, but they're just, once you've, you know, they just become more junk. So, I'd rather just go straight to the end. Okay. 
And going a little long on this episode, but I want to get a solid fuel, I'm sorry, a hydrazine thruster printed. Okay, so let's go ahead. We're going to grab you. We're going to come over here. And it's already on steel because I was looking at that earlier. That, that, and I need a carbon. So one over here. And then this takes 10 U if I remember to run, right? Yeah. And my wind turbine is going to wind down just as... Yep. <laughs> oh, well. All right, let's see if I can get this steel. How long is it going to take? Yeah, not too long. All right, so it was... Let's go back and see what the it was for that. Um, steel and an exochip. I'm definitely going to have to go underground pretty soon for uh, astronium so that I can get uh, uh, a trade for exochips. Because going around blowing things up for them gets a little bit old. There we go. And then hydrazine. Ammonium and hydrogen. So I do need another atmospheric condenser. I need to print one up. I should have brought the one back, but oh well. So, alright, this episode's going to go just a little bit long, because... Let's go ahead, we're going to attach you there. Oh, I have rewards from thin air. Ooh, oh, I should have... I should have... Oh, I couldn't have collected it over there. That's right. Okay. Uh, where did it go? There it is. Um, and then what was the other one? What does it want me to do? Fuel for thought. Create hydrazine. Well, I'm about to do that. And then composite... Oh, nanocarbonyl. Okay, it's going to be a while for that. All right. Um, I thought it was any... Um, any composite, but obviously that was not the case. Okay. <sighs> Hydrazine. Iron, glass and plastic. Glass. I hope argon is not a uh, flammable because that's a bad idea to have that right next to the, f the smelter. I don't know. I, I, you know, I should argon. Isn't that a? Oh my gosh, I can't remember. Isn't that one of the noble gases? I should know this. Chemistry was one of my favorite subjects in high school, and yet now I can't even remember. Oh well. All right, that's a uh, glass. Iron. Compound. And carbon. I'm going to need another platform. So let's go ahead and spin up a little bit of resin. Multitasking here. And I'm just, apparently I am meeting my energy demand. Oh, because I got a battery. Okay. And that battery is going to run out pretty soon. Oh! 
I saw a plus. Oh, because uh, this is done. Excellent. Um, I gotta wait till this printer's done. Oh, my goodness, I just want to take a nap. Okay. But yeah, this hydrazine, or I'm sorry, ammonium... This looks like a really good patch for an auto extractor, so I just, I don't want to touch it. I did grab a small amount of it, of course, from right here, but, or maybe that was even the resin. Okay, so yeah, I need hydrazine, or uh, hydrazine, I do need hydrazine, but I need uh, hydrogen to get the hydrazine, so... This is not going to be a very well laid out base. Probably going to have one episode where I just go back and rebuild this base better. Okay. There. Atmospheric condenser. Where did I put you down? Right. Come on. There. Let's go ahead and grab a little bit of hydrogen. And this is the planet where it's only, yeah, it's only 75. I think uh, it's Vesania or Novus where it's 100 PPU. So it fills up a lot faster. But still not worth going to those planets for it. <laughs> it just isn't. Um, about the only... I mean, I don't know. I just don't find either planet appealing. If I can skip over them, I usually do. Come on! I just want one. Just one. Just one. So close. So close. There it is. Okay. So I just needed the one. Come back over here. Drop you off. Hydrazine and then an ammonium. Sneak one of you. Oh, two of them. Oh, I forgot about that. And I always end up with an odd number. <laughs> always. Okay. Let that battery recharge. Excellent. So close. So close. Come on. And I forgot. I think I actually get a reward for this. The fuel for thought. I can't remember what the reward is. But this will complete one of my missions. Go, go, little wind turbine. Four and a half, you. And not even 50% of what I need. Yay. And there it is. Okay, so now I've got a lot more mobility around the uh, solar system now. Look at that, eight launches. Um, that's two round trips, so that's really darn cool. And I think this would be a good spot to say, um, a good spot to turn in 
because I have gone for a lot longer than I intended to with this episode. But our interplanetary uh, trips should be a heck of a lot easier now. What do we get for that? A hydrazine... <laughs> if I had looked at the rewards, I would have realized that. But now I have two of them. So, um, oh well. Uh, I'll remember that, and then I'll forget. But at least I have two of them now. Um, I could have saved myself a lot of trouble, but oh well. Because... Uh, yeah, I wouldn't have had... <laughs> if I had just done the hydrazine, I wouldn't have had to go through the whole rigmarole of the steel. I would have just got the thruster, but oh well. It was more fun this way. It really was, right? Right? It was more fun this way, right? <laughs> um, let's go ahead. We're going to drop you off there. And then... Come back over here. I'm sure we can get one of these dragon eggs going. I don't have the power to do all that, but I don't need the titanium that fast. So there we go. I have the hydrazine thruster. I have the large shuttle, so I will be able to get around the plan uh, the planets a lot easier. My next objective, uh, as far as old school objectives, would be an RTG. So that way my power issues are taken care of, and then I can just cont uh, you know continue to build. But next episode, I promise we're going to get back to the glastropods, and I'm going to pick up. Uh, start over. Uh, start resume uh, the Galastropod uh, missions, and then uh, we can see what the other ones do. So everybody, I really do appreciate you watching. I know that other people are way ahead of me on this already. Um, they've already done all the Galastropod stuff, and um, you know it, they're already bored with it probably. Uh, but um, I'm having fun. I'm having fun, and I hope you are too. So everybody, I will see all of you in the next episode. Take care. Let's get a little close in. There we go. Take care, and bye.